Hey YouTube, nerdies, nerdettes, what is good today? You already know who it is. I'm here today to uh, do a new format to my videos. Uh, decided to stop doing the pictures and the words for a second and just decided to infuse a little something else into the mix. So I'm going to see how this goes. This is a preview. I'm trying to show y'all. See how y'all like it. You know, comment, like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Here we go. Welcome back. I am here to give you my top 10 SNES games of the past. All my favorites that I used to play after I got out of school. And coming in at number 10, Super Metroid. I used to love playing this game because it was a good sci-fi blaster type game. And it was a real surprise when I found out that Samus was a girl. I didn't know. I'm sorry. And coming in at number 8, Smash TV. Me and my brothers used to love playing this game. It was one of them run around, shoot them up, collect all you can type of games. It was real fun just to go ahead and nerd out on real quick. And coming in at number eight, Maximum Carnage. Me being a big Spider-Man fan, this game was perfect for me. Carnage, Venom, Symbiotes, all that was just real, real nice for me. So this game got a thumbs up and got played. And who could forget about the cult classic coming in at number seven? Mortal Kombat. Sonya Blade, my favorite character. Jax is my second. Liu Kang is my third. But y'all already know. Everybody got their favorites. This game is God. Coming in at number six is also a cult classic. Castlevania. The Belmont Brothers was always busting Dracula head. I loved it. Y'all loved it. Tell me if y'all did. Comment below. And coming in at number five is everyone's round, lovable pink pal, Kirby. On top of being a super scientist and God knows how old, the man has a galaxy inside his stomach. That's all I can say. Go Kirby. And number four on my list is Chrono Trigger. Chrono and the gang are the first ones that got me on RPGs, the combo system they had, um, the, bat, the villain Magnus turning good, all that just sold me on it. And coming in at number three, not only is the name awesome, but so is the game. Bad dudes, walking along the streets, giving people the one-twos, trying to find your people, rescue them. This game was bad ass. And coming in at number two is the lovable toads, Raz, Zits, and Pimples, and the classic battle toads. Space cruising, beating up on pigs, trying to get the queen to give them their people back. You already know what this game was. And last but not least, my number one, DuckTales. Screws, Huey, Dewey, Louie, the Beagle Boys, Launchpad. They made my day after school. Well, thank y'all for sitting around, listening to my list. I will be back with more later. Y'all have a good one. Nerdies, YouTubians, nerdettes, I'm out.